The big VR story this year isn't another headset from Oculus or HTC, it's Microsoft's entry into the space with Windows 10 mixed reality devices. They promise to be cheaper and easier to use than the Rift or V, thanks to a bit of help from HoloLens. 3D tracking technology Acer was among the first we saw in action, and it was a promising example of what an inexpensive VR headset could look like. Samsung, meanwhile, was late to the party with HMD Odyssey, but it also gave us a glimpse at high-end mixed reality headsets. Now that we've spent some time with both, along with HP's headset earlier this week, it's time to decide which handles mixed reality best. The difference between Samsung's and Acer's headsets is immediately clear. The only thing remarkable about Acer's aesthetic is the glossy blue plastic visor, which, together with the rest of its design, makes it feel like a basic headset. It's a bit flimsy, almost as if it would break apart if it tumbled to the floor. Acer's choice of materials isn't inspired either, especially the cheap foam around the eyepiece. To the company's credit, the faux leather cushioning on the top and rear portions of the headband feels decent. Samsung's HMD Odyssey, on the other hand, is simply striking. That makes sense though. It was always intended to be a high-end showpiece for Microsoft's mixed reality platform. While it, too, is made of plastic, it's of a much higher quality than Acer's device. It looks and feels classier, and it's clearly sturdier. The built-in AKG headphones are also hard to miss. They give the entire device the aura of an expensive pair of audio gear. Samsung's headset is much heavier than Acer's. It weighs 625 grams versus 380, but the plush cushioning around its eyepiece and headband still makes it comfortable to wear. Samsung's headset even feels more premium than the Oculus Rift and HTC Vive. That's because the company was able to learn from those earlier headsets. The HTC Vive still gives off the impression of being a complex device meant for super geeks.